Uh, another another gritty win by our guys. Uh, wasn't of uh, work of art, but got to give the other team um, some some credit. They hit some really big shots and uh, got it rolling a little bit. But our guys, um, you know, we always talk about over the course of 40 minutes, um, you know, trying to impose our will and finish things out. And we gave up some runs, but we really did a nice job down the stretch. <coughs> Excuse me, down the stretch um, to put it away and contributions from a lot of guys. So proud of the fellows for sure. Um, Drew, Drew's a big player for us, and he's a, a big scorer for us. And um, I think everybody did a good job of stepping up when he got in foul trouble in there. Uh, G stepped in and uh, played well for us. And um, I think it was a team effort when he went down to uh, keep keep go keep it going and uh, keep a uh, rhythm going on offense. And G, what did you kind of see as your role when you got when you got thrown in there pretty early in that second half? I just wanted to compete and help my team win, you know. And that's what, what I what I did pretty much. Tried to pl play defense, help guys out. Box out, that was about it. And uh, Coach, does that uh, show you anything about your team being able to, to play you know, the way they did and, and, and succeed without Drew out there in both ends? Oh, for sure. I think that that's you know, it's a great thing. Obviously, we want Drew out there. And we know moving forward that G and Drew can play together. They did the second half of the league last year. The problem is, you know, you saw, excuse me, they went four guards. Um, and it, we played a lot of teams that play four guards. And, and it's been tough for G to get the minutes that we know he's going to get once we get down the road. But he's really hung in there. We always say, guys, you got to stay positive when you're on the bench and in a good, positive frame of mind. Because then when you're called upon, you're going to respond in a good way. You know, if you harbor any negative thoughts and, you know, why I'm not playing, why this, that, and the other, then when you get called upon, you're not going to have success. I, you know, you, you see that everywhere. So credit to him. And we thought uh, Seth Berger, uh, this, this was his, you know, high in minutes as a beaver. His defense the second half on Mayo was, was unbelievable, along with both G and, and Drew and, and Trace for a little bit. So it's nice that we've got developing some depth, especially inside. We're getting Ben back here before long, and we're going to uh, feel like th that, that will be a strength of, of ours. And, and then we got to keep developing some of these young guys. Um, it's going to be different guys, different nights. You know, Al Alfred, we, we, he's done some really good things. We went with somebody else, you know, tonight it might be somebody else's turn the next time. And, um, that, that's got to be the strength of our team if we all buy in and stay together. And Stevie, it's been a little bit uh, since you guys have been able to string some wins together. Um, what does that, if anything, say to you about the progress you guys are making right now? Um, yeah, we're making good progress right now. Uh, the, the wins haven't been pretty, but uh, we'll, we'll take them. Um, it feels good. It should give us confidence uh, moving forward, uh, getting a few wins in a row. Um, we're just looking to build on that moving on. Yeah, I mean Zach, Zach's played. You know, it, it's it's tough. You know, everybody that comes here is probably the best player on their high school team, and guys need to understand that the season is a marathon. You know, I mean, we were only seven games in going into today, um, and different guys are going to get different opportunities on on different nights, and what you do with it's going to depend on where you go from there and in practice. So tonight he came in. Um, we needed his grit. In his, in his hustle and, you know, the, one of the first possessions, he and Trace both dive on the floor for a loose ball. We come up with it. Um, he hits a big three for us when we were stuck in mud a little. So he's a gritty guy. He's got to continue to work on getting to know our plays um, and getting to know our coverages defensively. And we know that he's going to be, uh, you know, a real asset for us. So I was proud of the way he responded. And, you know, like you said, again, it's going to be different guys on different nights if everybody stays, stays in it together. And, uh, we're proud of the guys for doing that tonight.